Ryan Teeny here, professional snowboarder. Do most of my time in the backcountry. So for this episode, transfer hit me up. We're heading into the backcountry. We're gonna head up to Mount Kosciuszko. I'm a snowshoe out there. So we're heading into Rhythm right now to pick up some backcountry packs, poles, snowshoes. So yeah, our guest this week is Matty J. He's a TV presenter. Hit the road tomorrow. About to hit the road. And a fuck. All right, we're packed. We're about to hit the road and drive down a thread. He does a lot of adventure stuff all around the world, but he's never actually been to Kosciuszko before, and neither have I in the winter time. So, looking forward to getting out there with him and, and yeah, showing him the top of Australia. Mate, what is it? No shoes. Thank you. Picked up our stuff at Rhythm, we got our packs filled with all our backcountry gear. Yeah, the weather looks good for tomorrow, so we'll pick up the guys in the morning. Ready, good weather. So much better than last time we were up in the mountain waking up to fucking 60 kilometer wind. Got Matty J here, adventurer now. Yeah, I guess I'll take that title. Yeah. It's better than The Bachelor. Yeah, well, I'm not gonna like go down The Bachelor path. Huh? Hey, if you wanna talk about The Bachelor, nah, we'll talk nah, about The Bachelor. Nah. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> so. Bachelor needs to get like fleshed out, push, push to the side. Yeah, married man, children. Yeah, dad, adventurer. Radio guy. Podcast. What don't you do? Snowboard. <laughs> <laughs> I think the first time I went down to the snow was, I think I was like 11. Down and here? Yeah, it's, every time we drive down to the snow, it's always really nostalgic. We drove down, I'm one of five kids, and uh, we drove down from Brisbane. Uh, all the way to the snow. That was like the very first time I'd ever experienced snow. And I, it's so weird, every time I drive down, I always get flashbacks to like, being in this old car, looking out the window and seeing like my first little patch of snow and being like, can we stop the car? And like, <laughs> pulled over and like, touching it for the first time. I've, um, I've never done like a serious day of backcountry though. That's like the one box that I haven't ticked. Let's tick it. What's that? What happened here? He dri drives like a mania. <laughs> it's just valley wind, like the top will be sweet. Just got to the top of Threadburr. I'm gonna start our, our trek up to Cozzy. It's been, uh, the wind's been against us. It's been howling today. I love it. She is, she is howling, making it just a little bit harder with the board on the back. Hopefully, we make it before the weather turns on us. I'm not gonna lie, it's looking a little grim. Yeah, at least the wind is going with us on the way home, so it should be a quick, uh, quick adventure back. Yeah, you can, uh, you can hear us right now, but I think uh, with the wind, it's gonna be subtitles for uh, all you viewers at home. This is the hardest part, just for the top. Steepest, and I think we're both feeling a little bit cooked right now. So close. I'm out here just lugging a dad bot around, it's bloody, pretty rough. Someone's been so nice and built a nice little hole for us to uh, have our lunch in. We're abandoning mission because I think we want to survive. So. <laughs> We've got like a little bit of ice to deal with. Looking forward to like a bit better visibility on the way down. Conditions today. I concur. Good day, boys. We're filming. Sorry. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good day. Really. That good. was... Whatever, bro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go TV presenter style. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> now that's what I call a day on the mountain. That close, it's been like... Go without me. <laughs> yep. <laughs> good day. Cheers, brother. We summited Cozzy. Bloody hectic up there. Good spot for a little debrief. Fredbo's right there, so we're back to safety. That yeah. was a... Uh, it was gnarly up there. It was, I thought it was going to be no wind, sort of nice, sunny day. It just turned so quickly. It turned into a, a real mission. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when we, um, when we were strapping in, I was like, this is going to be, it's going to be touch and go for a bit. Yeah, at the top there, I was like, we should probably scoot. Super windy, no visibility. The worst snow ever. <laughs> yeah, rock hard snow. <laughs> well, that's the winter mission done. It was definitely an adventure, but now it's time to head home. Phew.